Have you ever wondered how to get the work that you really love to do and not just have to take on whatever makes the phone ring to make ends meet? Well, I can certainly shed some light on that for you right after this. Hi everyone and welcome back. I'm Scott Heimler and I am the creator of Successful Small Service Contracting where I show you how to control your income, your schedule, and your future with your own single operator service or contracting business. And I've taught hundreds of people how to be successful in their own businesses since 1999. The contractpreneur concept of operating your business as a single operator, seeking small repairs that don't cover you up and pay really well, is based in part on concentrated marketing for those specific small jobs or services that you love to do. They do not tie you up for a long time, and they pay extremely well. You know, the small and specialty type work. The type of jobs in your particular field that lets you get in and get out and on to the next job. Now, tying you up, for a long time means, you know, different things to different people in different uh, 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 specialties. But say the handyman, a, a quick, well-paying job may mean the honey-do list that, uh, that her honey keeps putting off. That list of repairs the wife has that she just decides it's time to get it done already. You know, and you get in there, you get in and out, and you're done. Do the carpenter, that may mean repairing the rod around the front entrance of the home or office, but not adding a room to a house. That would certainly tie you up for a long time. To the landscaper, that may mean a one-day spring cleanup around the house, but not a total re-landscape job. These small jobs require little, if any, help, have little materials in them, and are mostly your labor. One of the secrets of the successful small service contracting model is that it's difficult for home and business owners to get qualified on time clean-cut and dependable service and contracting people that will do the small jobs. And there's a ton of opportunity created for the person that is ready, willing, and able to do these type of jobs. Most repair uh, and service companies treat the small jobs like they're, they're more of a pain than anything else, and they discourage the client by overpricing the work or turning it down flat. And this, this leaves a ton of opportunity for the contract entrepreneur that is utilizing my choices menu pricing and profit calculator modules to develop four different levels and costs of the repairs and services that the client wants done. And I'm going to link to those in the description box below. Many times your clients and potential clients don't have a good feel for what the repairs or services will cost, so they want to get several cost estimates from different service or contracting people just to be sure that they're getting a fair shake on the job and you know to make their decision from there. When you create four different repair levels and costs of the different levels of the repairs or services for the client, it gives you the, the opportunity to hit the sweet spot in their budget. And many, many times, they do not continue shopping for other quotes, and this saves you a ton of time. This lets you claim the job over your potential competition because you've shown the client your confidence in your four repair and cost levels. Should the client want to shop beyond your four-level quote, let them know that you, know, you make it your business to know what your competition charges, and based on your experience in the field or the market, the levels that you created for them represent what shopping other contractors would reveal. And this will save the client much time and energy, and let them know that nicely. It's also safer due to not having several more strangers track through their home just to look at the same job. Be sure to specifically advertise and market for these best of the best type of repairs. So what is the best of the best? Well, this is different for everyone in, in different uh, uh, venues, but it's the repairs or services in your field that you love to do, and it pays the best. Decide what your best repairs are and always mention what you're looking for in each and every advertising or marketing opportunity that you have. In two separate modules of my uh, system, uh, the first one is Old School Marketing Magic, and the second is Maximum Return, Minimum Effort Online Marketing shows you how to do this quickly and inexpensively. This puts your best high-paying small jobs at the forefront of your new and existing clients' minds. Sure, you'll not always get the best of the best. You know That would be unrealistic, and I wouldn't be honest telling you that it would. But you certainly won't get any of the cream of the crop jobs or services that you prefer if you don't properly advertise for them either. As your advertising and marketing starts to pay off with the cream of the crop work, you start putting them in your schedule as the priorities 
and you fill in with the rest, less priority work. Soon your schedule is full of the best of the best, well-paying work that you love to do. Well, folks, that's it for today. I sincerely hope I have at least piqued your interest with this subject. It, it changed my life when I started developing my business with these methods, and I would like to help you. Please hit the subscribe button and the like button and ring the heck out of that bell, okay? And share this with anyone you might think it would help, okay? Let me know how I can help you in any way. Just leave a message in the comments or contact me at scott at contractorpreneur.com. And I thank you for your time today, as always. Take care.